Welcome to Planet Sparkle Fandango. Ooh. I'm Allison. I'm Kristen. And we're going to play Another World. Another world. Okay, so go ahead and... That's a, that's a soap opera title, mm. actually. Oh my god. So I didn't really get into soap opera so much because... Next time on Another World. Soap operas to me was just like really beautiful rich people kind of sort of doing it and then like hating each other because they were all shitty and uh, no dragons. So yeah, my mom liked them. And then right around the time that I think I, I don't remember the time frame. So it was either X-Files or Buffy. I'm going to say probably Buffy. Yeah. They had a plot line where one of the characters was possessed by the devil. It was very clearly like, oh, oh these alternate capturing shows the, yeah. are doing really well. Let's yeah. Um, so the reason we're playing this game is I played this for the Super Nintendo a long time ago, and uh, shh, yeah, shut your face! A long time shut ago, shut it! Shh, in the days of yore, uh, under the title "Out of This World," and uh, me and my friends rented it. And we were really fucking frustrated at first because we could not figure out how to make the game work and we right. were about to like fucking return it and then something clicked and we figured it out and once we figured it out it was one of the most unusual games we'd ever played up to that point there was not anything like it it was not a regular you know good old 16-bit game uh and so i've been looking for this game for the past like, fucking like 20 years and Shh. it's Shh. Jeff said he had it on Steam, so I'm like, oh my god, I've been trying to find this game! I, I mean, there must not have been very many Super Nintendo cartridges of it to begin with. 1990. Ugh. Yep, middle school. Shh. Shh. Time goes by. Yeah, Allison. shut up. It does. Shut your There's face. No stop shut it. it. You can get old or you can die. Those yeah, are your so choices. that's kind of my opinion about life is like, yeah, I'm old, but at least I'm not dead. So, bright side. Um, anyway. My boyfriend will always be nine years older than me, so I'm like, ha! Ah, I'm always gonna be younger than you. Enjoy your 40s. I'm, I'm still in my 30s. I'm older than... I'm older than my husband. Are you? Y'all are about the same age. One month older. Oh, psh. I'm to that point now where I kind of forget what everyone's ages are, so I assume yeah. we're also the age when we met. So I'm like, oh, we're all in our very early 30s. Shh. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah so, uh, soup operas. Su soup operas. Soup operas. Those sound better. Let's have a soup opera. Let's do it! Dream of mushroom. Tortilla soup. Chicken and stars. Chicken and stars. Chicken and stars. Butternut squash. Okay, it's got really, it's got really weird. Got kind of strange. Here we go. Soup opera, make that a thing. Soup internet. opera, that's gotta exist. Google I stopped shit. calling you guys America because we have international viewers. World, global. Yeah, but I think internet. You know what I'm talking about? Because yeah, I mean you can get the internet from We're space. We're family. So yeah. You could be talking. To people, oh my gosh, ISS you know, on the moon. Yeah. They yeah. had successfully hey. launched the Cigna. We Cygnus. we should Cygnus. we should get uh, astronauts watching our show. Oh my gosh, How astronauts! Do we get astronaut demographic, guys. We need to advertise to astronauts. A anybody knows any astronauts? Oh, get oh. them oh. up oh, on I'm, our show. I Are am apparently playing now. Oh, you're playing. There was well, there was so much. Like it never told me. Oh, we've released control of the game to you. I thought we were still watching the cinematics. <laughs> okay, well, I'm playing the game now. Okay. Okay. Uh, also, it's gonna take me a while to figure out what the fuck control because this is a like a PC game. Yeah, so like, like a how does port, this translate so, to an Xbox? Right. So yeah, give me a sec. Uh, you got it. Um. Oh, oh, it's a tentacle. Um, just gonna get out of here. It's tentacle. Tentacles Whoa. are bad. <gasps> Ew! Look at that. So you can watch it. Oh, super pixelated or res it up. Yeah, res it up. I'm gonna res it up. Res it up. Res it up. Res. Okay, I'm sorry. Um, soap operas. Soup operas. Soup operas. So, but my, everybody, all the girls, this is a great subject for Sparkle Fandango. <laughs> all the girls, though, in my, uh, oh. Oh, oh, shit. elementary school oh, slash, God. did you just get, like, poisoned by some creepy shit and yeah, die? Yeah, because I, I missed that. Oh, I wanted to start this over so many times. I, I missed the squash button. 
Oh, I got it. yeah. Sorry, sorry. Well, I figured this game out. It's cool. It's cool. I love you. Um. So okay, I got all it. the girls okay. though. In my junior high slash middle school really liked soap operas, so I tried to watch them so that I could be a girl. And because uh, I thought that's what girls do, they watch soap operas. No, kind of boring. My mom watched them like religiously, like yeah, taped them. But this was early on, uh, before she got a job. So like she just <laughs> cleaned the house and watched soap operas. Oh shit! Ah! I think I was supposed to run away from that guy. Oops. Oh good, isn't it? so? Please don't start me back off in that pool every time. It's gonna be a real boring gameplay. So you're just stepping on. Oh shit! Oh no. It's okay, so the problem is that the squash button and the run button are the same, so I can't. Oh, push I the direction. Yeah. You have to be still and squash. Uh, good to know. Oh, look out! There's one right there. Okay. It's very exciting. These guys very much remind me of some of the stuff you find in Odd World. I'm sure. I'm sure this influenced Odd World. I love. Odd we were gonna play Odd World. Um, on the show, but it's kind of a game you have to concentrate and be like. Ah! Run away! I'm just run gonna away! Jump ah! off! Okay, good. That's. I'm gonna run this way. Oh God! Here he comes! I don't no, no, no! No, 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 no! Whoa! The Tuscan Raider coming. It's it's um. Hey, dude. You're nice. Robid Guardian. How? How? <laughs> that's terrible. No, that's... Sorry. Um, sorry to any Native Americans on this show. Yeah, it's just oh, weird. Okay. Oh, what? shit. What? He shot you also? Uh, oh, it was like a you. stun shot, so he could take you to his human zoo. Oh, he might be a cyborg. Look at his eyes. Cyborg. Oh. Cyborg. Cyborg. Well, here's... Fleshy monkey dude. Rad. Oh, you just got all naked. I went to uh, high school with a couple of those. <laughs> Fleshy monkey dudes? Yep. Yep. Um, I have a really cool story to share. If okay. you, it involves drag queens. So I love drag queens. I thought I would bring it up during your uh, uh, hour. Our time together. Our time together, where we come together and we play video games. Uh, so last night we went to a show, uh, a rock show, downtown, and as we were passing Elysium, there was just like a porch, like a patio full of fucking drag queens. Like just, that is where the drag queens were, at a drag queen party. Uh, at least see him. It's, oh, he. You, I you, probably need to figure out how to shoot the gun. I think I'll need. I'll need to do that. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> you guys are both in jail together. Yeah. So we don't know why they've locked up their own kind. Okay. They seem kind of like dicks. Although they did save you from that monster cat. Yeah, but at what cost? Now I'm in jail. But at what cost? Anyway. So. Drag queen party. Uh, there was this one drag queen with, like, glitter, like, gl solid glitter eye shadow and just solid big golden glitter lips and, like, ombre hair going into this big thing. She was fabulous. And so I just, I stopped and I said, um... Oh my god, you're so beautiful. You guys look so beautiful. And then she came over and wanted to give me a kiss. Like, on my mouth. Um, which, I'm not a kisser. I'm not a kisser. I think that, fine, Europe. That's, that's your thing. That's what you want. You guys want to do and kiss each other all the time. Whatever. Uh, oh, there's a force field. That's why it's fucking me up. Oh. Okay. So but did, you figured out how did to you let her kiss you? No, I went in and I. Uh, but also, okay, so oh, I have that weird like you know like oh, I don't want to kiss strangers. I don't kiss. Is he just like he was just pounding like, on me? Just, dick. Okay, I think. I'm uh, going back. 
This I'd... way. TKO. <laughs> Maybe hide behind your buddy? Well, the thing is that he's throwing a force field. And uh... once he throws that force field... <laughs> I don't know what they're doing Ditch. slightly off, st off screen there, but it looks Ditch. naughty. Okay. Oh, um, okay, got it. So, not okay with getting kissed. I'm not, I'm not a kisser. And also, all I could think when I was going in to like, she was like, come and kiss me. And I was like, mm, no. Because I just didn't want to like, fuck up this amazing <laughs> glitter thing that was going on. It was just like, encrusted. Jewel encrusted lady face. Get on the oh, platform. I probably need Dingleberry. to okay. activate it. All right, it's pretty cool. That's funny. Yeah, I love the queens. Yeah, but it, they were looking good. And then, so with this hair color, pros and cons, right? Pros and cons. Uh, pro, uh, my hair looks the way that I want to. My hair, my outer hair, reflects my inner self. I feel like a person with fuchsia hair. I feel that <laughs> in myself. Right. Uh, con, not so employable. Pro, at least one person per outing. So I need to get Claritin at the Walgreens. At, uh, I want to get a sandwich at uh, the sandwich store. Um, I am passing a cortege of Drag queens. <laughs> Any of these situations, at least one person will say, I love your hair. And that's awesome. And so Jason and I just call it friendly hair. I have friendly, friendly hair. hair. It enables you to approach me and so that I can be friendly to your face, uh, which I like doing. I like being super friendly. Um, so each time that we pass that portico of lovely ladies, at least one of them would be like, I love your hair. Like, I love you. Thank you. I love your hair, too. Yeah. That's fun. That's my story. It's my story involving drag queens. Fabulous, fabulous drag queens. Um, what, do you think? what other stories do I have? Yeah, what do you, what do you, what's your purpose? Well, it, it seemed, I mean, ultimately I think it wants me to go to Penis Palace here uh, with the, the field Dude, of cocks. Traverse it is, the field of cocks. It is dildo apocalypse out there. <laughs> I don't know if we want to go out there, dude. It's all penis. It's a sausage party out there. That yeah. is the definition of a sausage party. Oh, brings up another amazing point. Uh, I hope that you have stayed tuned in thus far. Um, so a lot of sites on the internet that do genre entertainment podcasting content. Right? Oh, <gasps> oh I'm sorry, dude. Some of them will, we won't name specific ones like that I'm thinking of a little bit of a sausage party right it's just dudes hanging out with other dudes and talking about things that hey girls like too right yes I like uh I like I like geeky things right right I, I see my hair kind of matches um we like playing video games and hanging out yeah we might not always like, I haven't played this game on in 20 years, so I'm having difficulty right now, but I'm having fun. Yeah, so see, that. that's the point, right? We're girls, and we're having uh, fun. Wait, do you have to go kill... Oh, you can't get through that well, wall? Well, yeah, I... Do you punch it or something? I, I deactivated it from the lower level, I thought. Oh. I did some sort of energy field thing, but now this is still here, and I... I thought that guy was gonna help you his out. Magic. Oh, that guy's not what being very. Yeah, he's just sort of walking around like of mice and men. Yeah, I, I, because I, I already went to this lower level. Yeah, and there was this thing going on there, so I shot it, and then it stopped doing the thing. But I thought maybe he'd do something, but he's really not being very helpful at all. Huh. So um, I'm missing some vital information here. So at this point, I wish we had like a live show so you guys who 
freak out later when I miss something could like text me and I could read it. And I could we like, should do that. Thanks, guy. Now I know. We so. should do. We should do that. We should have a um, everybody play along with us. Show. Yeah, that'd be fun. And then you know you can watch as we play. And then if you see something, go left, go left. And you I can be helpful. Um, but okay, so right genre entertainment. Uh, too many dicks on the dance floor. Right. Too many dicks on the dance floor. Too many dicks. Too many dicks on the dance floor. Spread out the dicks. So, um, yeah, that's we want more lady-based content, but we want lady-based audience. And so, if you have ideas out there, if you know ladies who like you know stuff, ladies. you might. Right. Your mom was a lady. Your mom's a lady. Your mom's a lady. Um, or you're a lady and you're watching us. And you haven't commented before. Or you have commented all the time. And uh, we love you and we know who you are. Um, you guys should totally tell us. Oh, I just figured. Oh, okay. Hit the button a lot. I figured it out. Oh, no, that dude is now coming after you, I think. Yeah. Oh, oh dear. Oh, dear. I think what? I should have run down there and shot him first. Okay. Maybe it'll let you redo when you die right okay. now. Or we'll just... Maybe you go back down and hit, like, a, the Fuck. first build or something. Oh, no. Um, okay. All right. Well, we figured it's... it out. We figured it out. Okay. Um... So if you guys want to like, just how how do we how do we make this the lady powerful geek geek uh capital of awesome that it should be? Oh shit! I didn't push the red button. Does that make sense? Does that make sense, Internet? Yeah. How do we do that? How what would you like, ladies? Uh, slash fans of ladies. What do you want? What do you want us to do? Oh, no. Was that no. a bad guy? Yeah. Okay. Um, yeah. So, again, the problem is the directional versus action thing. You can't run and shoot. Oh, uh, could you in the original? Nah, I, well, this was, this was the problem with the original that we had was we couldn't fucking figure out how to make it happen. Okay, like, run, run, run! Um, go, go, go! Come on, fall. fall. Why am I not falling? Shit, come on! No. Nope. Did I have to push a button to fall? Do you have to be on, be, be on there together? Why are you not falling? Yeah. I... What happens if you shoot the wall? The other wall. It's not. I'm... You can't shoot it in that area? I'm not shooting at all. I'm hitting the action button and, yeah. and it's not shooting. Wait, uh, is this, is this a glitch or is it something I did? I guess you- Okay, I had to push down. Oh! Again, this is why- We got it. This is why we hated this game initially because there's no tutorial. You have no but that's idea. That's kind of cool. That's back how games were those days. You just mash buttons so you have to figure out what the fuck you were doing. And it's kind of cool from a perspective of like it's wrong way. Oh fuck. Yeah, from that perspective, <laughs> like just watching people fuck up. Yeah. And then, uh, I don't remember much of yeah, okay. how this game goes apart from like you get out of jail and you explore this planet. And obviously, dicks. And it's full of dicks. It's full of dicks. Dick planet. Did you notice that when you were that age? Or were you just like, no. Oh, no, no. I didn't. So many I dicks. I did not notice dicks at that age. Uh, especially not even, like, I remember Contra. As we've discussed, I think probably the very first Sparkle Fandango episode. That giant, giant Dick penis. monster? Yeah. I mean, we didn't think that as a kid, and I played it, you know. Later. Way later. I was like, holy shit, that's just a giant cock. After you'd seen... Oh my god, it's not working. Just run, just run. Oh my god. Oh, friend. Get you. Why don't you stop moving like he's, a slope? He's oh. stuck on stupid. He's. Oh, oh, you want me to go down there? Okay, I'll do it. 
Oh, 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 no, don't. Wait, what's going on? Oh, oh I got oh, farted oh. on by Planet Rude Sauce. <laughs> Okay. Planet, Planet Dick Burger. Oh, blood! I think I failed my grisly death. Hey, did you ever play Zork? No. Do you even know what Zork is? I do not. What is Zork? So this is how everyone knows how old I am. It's bad. Uh, but before there were video <sighs> games, there were text-based games. Oh, yeah. Um, <sighs> oh, fuck. And they've made several, but Zork was, I don't know if Zork was the first, but it was one of the first text-based scenes. And so it would just start out and it's like, you are in a field. And you'd have to type in commands to see if it would let you do what you wanted to do. So like, ah, ah. no warning. No warning. This is, okay, this is one of those games that you just have to memorize it. Like the, Fuck. like the original mazes in Zelda. I don't know how the hell. Yeah. How the hell we ever got through that game. I cheated. Like like a motherfucker. Just cheat. I'm still in Death Mountain. I seriously have like been slowly chipping at that game over the past 30 fucking years. I'm in Death oh Mountain. Oh my gosh. Death Mountain is so hot. It's so Death Mountain. That's going to be my new idiom for shit that just like is inscrutable. It's so fucking Death Mountain. Oh my god. This is Death Mountain, guys. Woof. Um... Yeah, so this reminds me this reminds me a little bit of Zork where you just have to I don't know, open the mailbox. In the mailbox is a letter and a bottle of water. Take litter. Take bottle of water. Move north. You just have to figure it out. And you would totally die so many times. Just dead. You have been eaten by a guru. So, um, yeah, this is one of those games. You just had to explore. Oh, here we go. Oh! I guess so. Now you're in the... Whoa. You're in the transportation chamber. You're you being beamed Did down I to the planet surface. Want that to happen? Oh, wait. It's an automatic door. I'm walking towards the light. Maybe you have to bring somebody... Oh, I didn't like that. Maybe you have to do something with that. Oh! Wait, no, move no. away from the open... Wait. Okay. Yeah, I mean, you must need to do something else. Nope, you can't... Blast. But you can blast through yeah, those, right? Blast, those. blast them. Maybe it's just a recharge station, because my gun keeps going out. Oh, it's a gun recharger. Maybe? Uh, again, you'll notice how this game had no tutorial, has no buttons, it doesn't tell you anything, which is how the games work. I think it's a pretty short station. I'm gonna imagine that's okay. what it is. Um, that makes just, sense. You didn't fucking know what you were doing, you just... Oh god! Oh god! Ah! Fight for survival! Um, oh, death. Right, so let's find the jump button. Oh wait, blow up the shit first. Why is there a force field now? Uh, so it goes force field and then it goes blaster. Oh. You can put up your own force fields? Yeah. Oh. Rad. Radmobile. I want one of those guns. That is a pretty cool gun. Okay. Suck it! Meat man! Okay, so B. <laughs> oh! <Okay>. Woo! <sighs> I um. thought that was gonna be intense. Are those spikes down there? Or can you like yeah, jump down? But now I'm kind of stuck here. But if you jump from there, will it kill you or the spikes? Only one way to find out. Death. That will kill you. Those are spikes. Doosh doosh doosh. Bloosh bloosh. Pew pew. Pew pew pew. It's not this game. That's more like a wow. Wow. I'm sorry, internet. That was <laughs> that was really weird. Um. So yeah, how do you think that? Uh, what do you think that? Ah, it didn't push oh, me. Oh, 
This is a very like stop. Push another button game. You can't it, you can't do si simultaneous actions. I'm finding. Ah, uh. it doesn't seem to like me to run and jump. <sighs> that's that's just that's balls. Um, but seriously, what do you think that uh lady lady geek gaming ladies want in funny I hope we're being funny although I still kind of can't figure out why people whatever oh there you go yeah figure shit out blast some shit open blast some shit open yeah okay what do you think we should do what are your opinions oh me mama uh, sure would like... Man, wouldn't it be sweet if you get, like, a super high-profile guest, like, Felicia Day or something like that? Oh, yeah! She does owe me one, if you're listening, Felicia Day. <laughs> the time I got in a fender bender with, with your very, very clever mother, you owe me one. Yeah. I mean, that would be super cool. Um, I don't, I don't, I don't know what are, I mean, what are the lady geeks doing out there? That is, um, that's a good idea. Uh, if you are out there... And you watch us, and you, I don't know, you could even be like, that going to be good. There's bones right there and some kind of wavy tentacle thing that looks like the car wash wipers. <laughs> <laughs> At the car wash. And there's spikes. And spikes Ooh. and spikes. Oh, uh, I'm going to go with not the way I want to go. Well, can you, oh, do, wait, maybe you could blow up that thing right there. I am, that's what I do. Um, that made it worse. Uh, <laughs> oopsies. That definitely made it worse. Oops. Uh, I guess you're just gonna have to bite it. You're just gonna have to suck it up and go to, gonna, go forward. Let's go run! Oh. No. That's not what I wanted to do. Um, yeah. If you are famous, you can be internet famous. I don't care. That'd be nice. And you want to be on Sparkle Fandango. Um, ladies, famous ladies of the world, you <laughs> be on Sparkle Mandingo, it's cool. Uh, we also want everything to be super fun, so, you know, don't bring any kind of, like, hate rays up yeah, in here. No, this is, this no is a worries. fun show. It's all about the fun. It's all about the fun. <gasps> oh, yeah, maybe you had to go down, like, a different tube or something? Yeah, I think, and oh. Not that not one. Not that one. <laughs> That one was no bueno. That is the two. That's the vagina dentata <laughs> tube. Ew. Do you guys know what I'm talking Ew. about out there? It's actually from. Well, I've seen it in Native American legend. Oh uh, really? Yeah, I actually, have a really a, a big book of Native American legends, and that's one of them. Might be the source of having <gasps> those two tubes are bad. All those tubes have. Oh, you know what? Yeah. I just now realize every time I go back and watch our show, I am like fucking creepy breathing into the mic all the time. And it drives me fucking crazy. And no one's called me out on it yet, so maybe you're not noticing, but I'm like, hey. What are you wearing? Hey, sailor. <laughs> Have you ever gotten, gotten one of those calls? Me? Have you ever gotten a, hey, baby, what are you I wearing got, calls? I got it once, once. And I was too young to know what he meant. <laughs> And so it was only in, in, in retrospect. But yeah, I, I picked up the phone and some dude was like, I want to lick your puss. And I just was like, what? That's weird. What? Cats are really not sanitary. <laughs> and I don't no. think that you should do that for you health reasons. Shouldn't. Uh, my mom. So my mom started keeping a whistle uh, next to the telephone. And she's like, if you get any weird calls, just blow the whistle. Blow the whistle. And their yeah. face. I got one. <sighs> yeah. Do it. Just do it. Do, do it. it. Blow shit up. I'm gonna drown. Drowning. Okay. Oh. Okay. Can't do that. Can't do that. Apparently. Oh man. <sighs> okay. Um. So. Yeah, I got one of those calls once, but I totally didn't realize that that was what was happening. I thought it was just one of my friends calling and being weird. Uh, I was working at a little shop, 
on a street that was sort of like a drag, like a main drag next to a university. I was a shop girl and I would sell, you know, Nine Inch Nails t-shirts <laughs> and interesting hippie rings and um, what else did we sell? We had candles and socks. It was just a cute little store. Can you like hit it once and then run away real fast? Like with it like a like a pew pew pew, not the bomb gun, but the pew gun. No. Uh, maybe yeah, maybe I should okay. Force field. No. No, I think you're right. Oh, no, you can't make it force field. Working. Okay, for whatever reason the force field doesn't work. Maybe it doesn't work in the natural caves. Maybe it only worked in the penis penis right, palace. So Oh, I also forgot to push A, because <laughs> I'm an idiot. <sighs> so oh, well, it's fine. You guys can just listen to my story about getting a, a, oh, yeah. a sassy story. call. Um, so I was doing my shop stuff. I got a call at the store, and I'm like, hello, shop name. This is Allison. What's up? I didn't even try this way. And, um, oh. oh, there we go. God. Uh, the person on the other end was like, hey. And I was like, hi, uh, is this, uh, is this John, one of my friends? Uh, names are changed to protect the <laughs> assholes. Um, is this John? Yeah, this is John. Oh, hey, what's up? Yeah, hey, what are you doing? Oh, I'm just working, you know. Uh, well, what are you wearing today? Like a oh. shirt and some pants and stuff, like shoes, socks. Do you have underwear on? Yeah, I got underwear on because that's, you know, generally a hygienic thing to do. Uh, and you can wear your pants more than one time. Uh, so that's what I do. I wear underwear. What kind of underwear do you have on? Oh, uh, you know, just practical ones, like the cotton ones from Victoria's Secret. Uh, what color are they? They're black, but just because, you know, that's what the laundry dice rolled up for me today. Uh, but they're just practical ones. Why do you care about what color underwear I have on? That's weird. No, girl. I want you to take them off. And I was like, what? Like, in the store? I can't do that. Why? Clueless. Clueless. Oh, shit, I didn't mean to do that. Clueless is a super clueless. Aww. Had no idea. And eventually they hung up because they got bored of... See, that's even better when you call people like us when we're not playing along. <laughs> yeah. You're like, I don't know what you were expecting when you call me. Like, yeah. You're I, not going to get what you want. I have some sure. regular underwear. Today, guys, super ordinary underwear. Whatever. I tend to find that's the preferred underwear. I'm like, sometimes I have some I'm hot. I'm the only one seeing this underwear today, so I'm wearing the granny panties. I have some okay. hot britches. <laughs> it was some hot britches. But whatever. It's just laundry dice. I open the drawer. They're all there, and I just sort of like mm, mm, magic claw down in there. And, oh, look. Uh, but yeah, I totally ruined that guy's, that guy's attempt. And I thought maybe at the time, like maybe, like I looked back and I was like, I think that guy was trying to like sexy phone call me. Because I don't think that that was my friend. <laughs> Huh. Huh. And then I would like do them like who could that have been? Is it one of the dudes from the bagel place? Uh if so, like I'm sorry, bagel place dude. I probably really did not help at all with your quest for some I don't know, intrigue or reaction. I often want, like, one of those crazy, like, you see in the old movies where the dudes would, like, whip open a raincoat and there'd just be, like, naked dangly bits. <laughs> and then the ladies would all be like, <gasps> I'd be like, yeah, whatever. Yeah, same here. I just be like. You got a dick. So do half the people on the fucking planet. I saw a guy. guy. I was on a road trip once and this guy was totally, like, masturbating while he was driving. And, like, you know, like, pulling up next to us would be like. And I was like, oh, showing off yeah, that he was masturbating. Was like, so good for you. I don't. Good. It's good for your prostate health. Please don't run into somebody that's not 
Very oh, road safe. Yeah, it's not road safe, though. Please masturbate, because it's good for your health. But... Not while you're driving. Not while you're driving. You no. know, that's like that's like texting and driving. Don't text while you drive. Uh, don't try to eat cereal when you drive. That's an Arrested <laughs> Development joke. Or no, that's a, um, Always Sunny in Philadelphia joke. Don't do that. Don't eat cereal while you drive. Uh, yeah, anything involving silverware while you're eating, that's why, you well, know, eat a burrito maybe, but... Me, only if you have an automatic transmission. I had a senior transmission for years. It was you, I could not eat and drive unless it was highway and you oh, were wow. always in fifth. Look how much they look. Pixelated version, <gasps> revamped version. Wow. Nice. Well done, guys. That looks yeah, really cool. this looks really great. So you want to just uh, recap on the game? I'm very confused right now because at two levels up, I'm in waterfall, waterfall, right? And the waterfall is like going to this well. But we've already known like, if I shoot this, that you die. That I die. And I can't figure out how to get across the waterfall because if I get across, if I try to walk into the waterfall, I drown. And all these other pits lead to spikes. Maybe there was one more pit I didn't go. I don't know if I've forgotten. Well, anyway, anyway, I'm confused. Anyway, Internet, if you dug this game, you can totally check it out and it's solve this puzzle. It's yeah, on Steam. It's on Steam. Um, I guess it's a real throwback game to those early gaming years. It's a very PC game. Not politically correct. I mean, on the PC itself. Um, and it is super fun, and I want to keep playing it. Uh, I'm going to have to... I'm not, i got to get a computer. <laughs> I really do need a PC to be able to do the Steam stuff. Yeah, yeah. We were talking about that ourselves. It's time. Like, I don't have the kind of money, though. Yeah. Uh, also time. Also time. You know what? I so just kind of early just... I want to take this year off from Comic Cons and just sew dresses for myself. Dude. I'm so fucking tired. So, huh. Super Talented makes all the wonderful squids. Yeah, run like the, run like the wind! Run like... Oh, there we go. <sighs> Do I ah! Ah! Fuck! Shitting farts! Ow, I had it. Had Goddamn it, nerds! I lost it. I lost it. Fart. Okay, but we figured it out. I definitely did what I was supposed to do. Okay, there you go. Resolution. Um, but anyway, yeah. You know how to uh, get in touch with us at Sparkle Fandango, at Malison Murphy, at Kayla Crow, and at Sparkle Kristen. And uh, you can comment. Um, we are how we have some new exciting plans for the new year. We had a team meeting. Team. Go team! Um, and we have all kinds of new shit planned. Dudes. And after a... Uh-oh. Gonna after, be so exciting. After um, a two-week hiatus for the holidays, the Sparkle Tumblr is indeed back, so uh, please continue to send your Fan Art Fridays... Ah! Fan Art Friday. Do it. See, this is like texting and driving, playing and talking. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's the best part of my week, pretty much, is just seeing your amazing shit. There so. was a lot of good stuff, but I really, I, I, there was one in particular. It was Pug's drawing of us with, like, the little orphan Annie eyes. That was fantastic. I really liked it. It was very cute. I also liked the one of uh, us as uh, Judith and Holofernes. Oh, oh, from the painting? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, that was a good one, too. <laughs> <laughs> Let me chuckle. <laughs> that was funny. <laughs> Sick. Cutting off heads. Anyway. Cutting off heads. Come on, come on, come on, do Cut. it. Oh, oh. You. See, again, if I could run and jump at the same time. Can't do it. You did I'm it, though. Trying, it's guys. possible. I'm fucking trying. I'm so, sorry. Anyway, get in touch with us. Lady Gamers Unite. Let's uh, let's figure that shit out. Let's bring all the ladies together. Mm. If you have lady friends, simply invite them to watch our show. Yeah, Sparkle Universe. Let's let's make it a thing. Sparkle. Um. Anyway, you guys have a great week, and we'll see you next week on Sparkle Fandango. <laughs>